Don't need no mentions Yeah, these are my only intentions Shout out to your mom and dad for making you Stay in a vision, they did a great job raising you When I create, you're my muse The kind of smile that makes the news Hello there, lovely people. It is I, Isla Ray. Hope everybody is well. Now, you have seen me do... Well, I mean, it's only been really just one video of just, like, makeup. But now, we're gonna kind of take it up a notch. And I'm going to basically show you guys, like, a few outfits of where I would, like, wear them out to. So, for instance, like, a certain dress would... Be, so certain outfits for certain occasions or events or something like that that's pretty much it uh so without further ado let's get into it all right first is that recording okay i can't tell sorry anyways this is the first outfit this um i've worn this before but obviously it's been a while there is like a lot of outfits i have like also including the ones that are like right here on the side of my bed um that i haven't worn in forever most of which are sweaters and obviously i can't freaking wear this because it's too damn hot to be wearing sweaters but um yeah this dress i would wear this okay first of all i just want to say this would be perfect for like spring or summer because it's a little bit because i mean well summer because it's hot and you want to be cool so you know a dress is usually the move but if you but if i would wear this in the summer i wouldn't have the t-shirt on this is actually like you can like the freaking the shirt isn't attached to the dress so you can easily just like you can wear it with or without the shirt why was that so hard for me to say oh my lord <laughs> anyways but yeah so during the summer oh my god during the summer I would wear this without the shirt just because since this shirt's pretty like tight under here I sweat more and I don't want that so I would just wear this without the without the shirt and then obviously during the springtime I would wear it with the shirt because at least it's a little bit cooler to wear it out with the shirt as far as like what type of event I would say like a like a, a lunch a casual brunch depending on where we're going as far as the shoes I would not do heels since this is okay no actually with the shirt i would do like sneakers or something like that maybe like converse or maybe even air forces even though i don't own a pair <laughs> um i i ironically enough that is that is exactly how i wore this outfit when i put it on the first time i had some air forces with this um but yeah with the shirt i would do some tennis shoes my care voices and without the shirt mm, it really depends i would probably say heels but not like super high heels it would have to be like the small ones or maybe even like some wedges like not even heels maybe wedges depending on the style but yeah also i got this just from dd so yeah spring or summer outfit summer without the shirt spring with the shirt air force or tennis shoes tennis shoes with the um with the shirt heels or wedges with no shirt that took way too long i'm sorry anyways next outfit hello there anyways next outfit <laughs> that was really awkward i'm sorry uh if you can't tell what color this is this is like Burgundy, burgundy or maroon? I forget which one's lighter. It's it's one of those two. I'm pretty sure this is burgundy because maroon is a little bit lighter. Anyways, uh, obviously we took a pretty drastic turn. Obviously we wear this in the fall because fall is well no fall and winter have darker colors. Usually obviously in the fall there's like red orange, red orange yellow brown. And stuff like that but usually in like darker shades and then during the, the christmas time it's like darker shades of blue red green stuff like that uh this where would i wear this to, to be honest mm -hmm. i would probably wear this obviously during the fall um 
I wouldn't say to the pumpkin patch. I feel like that calls for more of like a regular shirt or just like a like a casual fit. This is more like out on the town. So not even so like where wherever we go, this is the fit that I'm rocking. Which I can probably say for a lot of these outfits, but I feel like this is just more like a fall out or an out on the town fall edition. So like going to go get pumpkins or like um, going to Bath and Body Works or something like that, or even going to the bookstore. You know, yeah. This is honestly. Oh shit! Can't see me. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. Um, I would say reading books for sure. Yeah, definitely reading books. But this is like again out on the town fall edition all right now we're gonna go to the next outfit all right um what the fuck my train of thought okay again we're back at the game with the sweaters okay for those of you that don't know a little fun fact about me well no it's it's not even a fun fact i mean i mentioned it in the q a video about how much i love fall or there was a question regarding to fall, but regardless, I love fall. It's the only time of year I look forward to anyways. So again, we're in it with, with the sweaters. This is what the majority of my closet consists of. It's mainly sweaters or long sleeves because in all honesty, I hate summer clothing. I just, I cannot do it. It's just, summer is just so unbearable in Texas. It's, ugh. Anyways, so again, this would be fall. Obviously, this is a... I wouldn't even call this mustard yellow. It's a darker yellow. And it's funny because I've always hated yellow just because it was just like too bright. But if it's like fall yellow, like a darker yellow, like like mustard yellow, just like I mentioned, then I'm cool with it. That is the only time you will probably ever see me wear yellow. If we're talking like hints of yellow, if we're talking hints of yellow, that's fine. But like a whole like bright shirt, of it no absolutely not anyways this is a, a casual fit i feel like this is honestly i would say mm, where would i wear this to where would i wear this to oh okay I forgot to mention for the black for the black and the maroon pants i would wear probably biker boots or vans i just feel like man had to go put that outfit anyways this Again, fall outfit. As far as where I would wear this to, honestly, I feel like I'd probably go to the coffee shop, honestly. The coffee shop. The coffee shop for sure. Um, the coffee shop, maybe, where would I go, honestly? Yeah, coffee shop. Um, la 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 la. Probably to the pumpkin. No, definitely not the pumpkin patch. I feel like that would be. I mean, I just said, like, in the first. Well, I d didn't even mention it. But I would have a, a more casual fit if I went to the pumpkin patch. This just screams, like, coffee. I would say book, but. Yeah. Yeah, coffee and maybe shopping. Ooh, shopping for candles. Shopping for candles. Yeah, so going to go get coffee, shopping for, or no, just shopping in general, but for fall stuff, you know, it's, especially if you're like baking, like sweet, baking sweets. Yeah, so coffee and shopping. This is where I, this is where this outfit will come into play. As far as what shoes I would do, um, hmm. shoes, okay. I've done this outfit before, but I don't remember what shoes I wore with it. I would do ankle boots. Ankle boots are like a is like a staple in fall fashion. So yeah, there's that outfit. Next one. All right, we're going or we're taking it down a notch. This is actually a very casual outfit. Okay, the crew neck. This is actually from Christopher Soniolo's Fresh Love brand. Obviously, I haven't worn it because, like I've said so many times, it is too hot to be wearing a sweater or a crew neck or just a long sleeve in general. Um, I have on some very casual pants. I mean, I've... Okay. 
remember when I did the Timu haul on here? Well, on my TikTok, which I, which you should go follow. Um, I did, or I like modeled the stuff I got off of Timu. That's where these pants are from. Anyways, this is again a very casual. I already know what I would wear this to. I probably wouldn't even wear it like that because I, I. I underestimated how big this actually was, and I'm pretty small. Well, size, not regardless. This is, yeah, this is kind of big, so I would like fold it at the bottom right here. But anyways, um, I would wear my Adidas with these, which are black. Um, I would wear this to the. This is like movie fit, you know. Like, I yeah, this is like movie fit. Um, movies late evening activities or early yeah early evening activities so if like you're going out for pizza and then you go out to the movies and then maybe you hit at the arcade or some shit like that you know just different shit like that yeah but this screams movies i just hit the wall and didn't even realize it um this screams movies slash doing early evening activities you know going out for pizza something like that but yeah All right, now we're, okay, I couldn't tell if it, if it went or not, sorry, <laughs> again. Um, so now we're taking it up again with a dress. This dress is like really long, like it, it touches the floor. So I don't have to wear this with heels because, well, or no, I can go get it, re I can go get it readjusted, but I kind of don't want to just because every time, and you can't tell me, then you don't do this well for my ladies at least um my mind is like racing and i'm trying not to like go so fast anyways but because of the fact that this is like so long like i thought about getting it like readjusted so i wouldn't be constantly like tripping at the or just tripping over my dress and then i was like well i kind of like it like this just because i feel like you know like a princess and they're like running down like the court court the hall or like de like down a staircase and like their dress just like flows and they're just like i'm literally close to do this but where, where it's just like you know or something yeah <laughs> pretty much um i don't even remember where i bought this where did i buy this I haven't worn this since I bought it because, I mean, I don't have anywhere to wear it to, so it's just been sitting in my closet. Rue 21, that's where I got this from. Rue 21, that's where I got this from. This, honestly, I'm wearing this in Italy if I ever go to Italy one day. <laughs> that is the only thing. This is like an Italy type of dress. Like, like I don't know. Yeah. I have way too much fun with that. <laughs> But yeah, this is like, if I'm going to save this for Italy, you know what? Yeah, we're going to save it for, for, yeah, we are going to save it for Italy. So when I'm out on my own and I'm like traveling and, and stuff like that, and you just so happen to see, oh, hey, Italy vlog or something like that. And you see me in this dress. Yeah, don't say, don't say, I mean, like, I told you so. <laughs> I told you so. Anyways, next outfit. All right, this next one, this is a skirt, by the way. I'm just, I'm very short, okay? Um, I've worn this, I've worn this outfit before. Um, okay, I can say that about a lot of my outfits, but like, obviously, again, for the millionth time, can't wear it because it's too goddamn hot. Anyways, this is obviously a fall outfit. This would be like... This would be like like a fancy brunch or something like that. Like a fancy brunch. Um, as far as shoes, I would probably do like some open-toed, like, what is this? Navy blue? Navy blue, a darker shade of blue with this. Or maybe even white, honestly. I feel like, okay, when it comes to, like, if you have like a solid top or a solid colored top, and you have like patterned like bottoms whether it's a skirt or whether it's like a pair of pants a skirt or something like that i usually try to go for the colors that are within like the pattern so like this for instance there's like 
two different shades of blue and like white and cream on it so i can do either one but the first time i wore this i wore what color did i wear i wore my navy blue um what are those shoes called? God damn it. I have like five pairs of these in my closet and I don't know what they're called. The pointed toe shoes, like the ones with the, like, you've seen them before. I'll probably insert a picture or something like that, but, um, yeah, I would wear this with like, I probably wouldn't do the, the pointed toe flats again. I'd probably do heels because I really, yeah, I would definitely wear heels with these. Ignore my socks. They look really weird. Yeah. So heels with this and then this is kind of like either a brunch or like business meeting type thing honestly i can dress very formal believe it or not it's just i don't obviously i don't go out enough to dress like it so a lot of people are just like mm. so i can dress but, but i can dress it's just my fesh my fesh what english hello um my fashion sense is completely different from everybody else's so while everyone else is like so my version of casual is different from everyone else's and i typically go for clothes that are like loud vibrant flashy basically clothes that represent my personality so anyways yeah business meeting um brunch fall brunch if you will is this recording i keep Sorry, <laughs> for like the third time, I'm sorry. Okay, this is a dress. This is a very long dress. There's like a slit on the side. I wore this dress before. My cousin actually got it for me. Shout out to you, cuzzo. Um, I would wear this with obviously a pair of heels. As far as like what kind, or no, not what kind, but like what color, I would definitely do black or I think I can't tell if, if that's blue or purple. It looks, I don't know. It's like, the color is just like really messing with my eyes. But, um, okay, no, wait, backtrack, backtrack. Yeah, backtrack. I've worn this before to a New Year's party. Um, and I wore this with sandals just because, I mean, there was no need for heels. So I, I just wore like black sandals with it and it, it worked. I made it work, okay? Anyways. This, I would definitely wear with heels. This screams date night. I would not wear this anywhere else other than a date night. Probably somewhere out of, somewhere in Europe. Just like that other dress, okay? Just like, just like that other dress. I'm probably going to be in somewhere in Europe. It probably ain't going to be Italy, but regardless. Um, yeah, this, this screams date night. So, yeah. Date night. I would wear either black heels or you probably can't see the color but hold on if you like look can you tell if that's blue or if that's purple somebody let me know please well no i should not well never mind next outfit <laughs> okay i keep never mind anyways okay a lot of people or no a handful of people have seen this dress but the thing is i have not worn this since i bought it which I can say for like a lot of other things in, in, in my closet. Why am I having a hard time speaking today? Anyways, um, it's so funny because, okay, I actually used to hate wearing brown. I thought brown was just like, I just did not like it. But now, or no, it, it wasn't until last year when I was at Route 21 and I was like shopping around, just like shopping around. And I came across a brown bodycon dress and I was like, okay, this is kind of cute. You know, this isn't so bad. And now I'm just like, as time passed, I've become more fond of the color. I feel like it's more appropriate for fall just because, you know, I mean, I, I honestly associate brown with fall because it's very comforting. Brown's a very comforting color. Well, it depends on the shade. If, if it's like this, like the one on my dress here, then it's comfortable. But like anything darker than that, it's like, mm. well, it depends on the shade. Anyways, this is a color black dress. Uh, again, I have not worn this. And I actually really like the dress a lot. Um, where would I wear this to? I, okay, wait, no, first, shoes. I would wear brown heels. 
I would wear brown heels with these, but not like super tall heels, just like the ones where, where it has like the chunky heel, but it's not like super high. You know what I'm saying? Excuse me. This would be like a, like a lunch date, honestly. Yeah, a lunch date. This would definitely be like a lunch date. Well, if I'm spending the day with like a, with like my partner or whatever. Um, yeah, but I would say more of, of like a lunch date depending on where we're going. But yeah, that's all there is to that one. We are on the last outfit now. All right, and for the last outfit, again, nobody has seen this dress or has like seen me in it. There's, again, so just like the other dress I had on, there's like a handful of people that have also seen that one, but not like me in it. Same thing with this dress. I believe I bought this from Route 21. Yeah, I did, I did. This is very much 70s. And honestly, I didn't even want to even put this like in the video. Like this was a dress that I did not want anybody to see me in because I wanted to use this for like, if somebody has like a 70s party, boom, I could pull this out, you know, put on my go-go boots, you know, just go crazy with it, you know? But I was like, nah, never mind. Don't nobody give a fuck about all that. Anyways, this is, this, would honestly be like I don't even think I would even wear this out. No, I I probably would because I I like to wear flashy outfits. <laughs> well, it depends on what I'm doing. This again would definitely. Sorry, I thought I freaking heard. I heard somebody knocking. That was such a late response. Anyways, I'm getting off track. This would be I would probably only wear this to a '70s party. I really don't imagine seeing myself when it's anywhere else unless if i'm like out on the town just like running errands or something like that you know just yeah just honestly either a 70s party or me just going out just for the hell of it not even really doing anything so yeah i love the dress i oh my god i need to freaking get some go-go boots because i feel like these are the only shoes that would like go with this dress you know Forgot to film the outro. Don't know how I managed to do that, but here we are. Um, anyways, as always, hope you enjoyed that very chaotic video. Um, honestly, I'm going to be honest. I feel like most of the content I like, or some of the videos I've posted for the last few weeks have felt kind of rushed. I don't mean for it to appear that way, but if it seems that way, I'm sorry. Also, another thing I... You know what, I think I'll do a post on it instead because me saying it is just going to be confusing. But anyways, again, hope you enjoyed that very chaotic video. If you haven't already, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And if you don't, that's okay too. See you guys on Thursday. Bye.